Hello everyone, Xantos here, and welcome back to Grand Kingdom. Uh, another tutorial video on how to get the secret chest in the Infiltration Mountain Range Zone. Uh, this one was a little bit tricky, um, definitely a lot easier compared to the first one that I did. Uh, again, we are just going to go in here and show you the steps on how to acquire it. Uh, there is one part that uh, is pretty difficult for me to kind of go through, so I'm not going to be able to like tell you exactly how it's set up, but try your best to like follow uh, my steps as much as possible. I know you can overcome to, any uh, difficulty, boss. Uh, do it for yourself here. Uh, the first part is you now really easy. You pick up your yes! whistles, you wave right here, you use your first whistle. Then you simply go up here one time, go across, come up here, use your whistle right here. Then just go around. Now wait right here and go ahead and use your next whistle. And then just wait here one turn, go down, and you're gonna do your little dance with this guy here. Yes! And you're gonna do one more set. Then you're gonna go across this path here. You're gonna wait on here and use your whistle one more time. Cross, and we're going to cross one more time. Now this is the part that uh, gets a little tricky, so I'm, going to, I'm not going to be able to tell you exactly how to do it, but try to follow my steps pretty close to it, and you should be fine. Uh, first thing I definitely know, you need to wait here five turns, and go one, two, three, four, five. Uh, to the point where they're positioned like this, where the top one is facing to the left and the right one is facing to the right. Um, then you just simply go up, up, left, grab your first chest, yes! then uh, this is where it starts to get a little tricky. Um, I think we can go right here, and then we use our first whistle right here, or not our first, but our next whistle. Uh, so go ahead and use it one time right here. Then you're going to go down, left, down again, go across, I wonder where it leads. wait right here, go across, grab your next chest, yes! come down here, then wait one turn, then let's see if I can make sure I'm able to do this without getting trapped. Yeah, I think you should be able to go right here. So you go left one time, then you go down and grab your next chest. Yes! Then, I believe you have to wait here, of course. Um, just trying to figure out if I can leave after that. Uh, can I leave? Hold on, I don't think, yeah, not yet, not yet. Now you should be able to go. Uh, so you basically wait down there two times until they uh, are positioned to how they were. Then you go out. And then you're going to circle around and go out this way. Then you're going to wait here one turn. Then you're going to go ahead and use your next whistle. You're going to go up. That looks clear. Let's go, boss. You gotta wait here one turn. Go across. Hidden path. I wonder where it leads. And go ahead and use your whistle one more time. And we're gonna wait for this guy down here to do his little. That looks clear. Here. Let's go, boss. Then again, we just do our little dance with him. So he's gonna go over there. You just wait there. Go across. Down. Up, right, and then you're gonna come here. Now this is where you're gonna basically be using two of the crisp, uh, whistles at the same time. Uh, so we first wait right here to where he's like positioned like that. Uh, you're gonna go ahead and use your first uh, nasty whistle. 
one time. Then we're gonna let him go, uh, wait here one time to go across. Then you move up, then you use your whistle one more time. That'll be the last time you have to use it, obviously. Uh, then you just go across with your greedy feathers to get the secret chest. Yes! This is the Harley Quinn flag, which I'm kind of interested in to see what it's like. Uh, then you come down here, and it's just a simple as uh, just uh, waiting for the path to um, where you actually can go across. So you just wait here one time, jump across, jump across, and you'll wait right here, use your supplies, and use your danger feather to go to this little boulder here. And then you just simply use your uh, disaster talisman. And you're done. So there you go. So let's go ahead and see what the uh, Harley Quinn uh, flag looks like. I mean, again, it's a little tricky at that one part, but uh, as long as you follow my, you know, uh, directions as much as possible, I know that it, I was a little sloppy there uh, during that part, but after that, it's fairly easy. As long as you follow my steps, uh, you should be fine. You should be able to get this yourself. But anyways, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully you find it helpful for you to be able to get your own Harley Quinn flag. Uh, again, if you have any questions, uh, let me know in the comments. Uh, but I just want to go ahead and thank you guys for watching, and uh, we will, you know, keep on doing this until we get all the uh, secret quest flags. Uh, but until then, you guys continue staying awesome, and I'll catch you guys next time. Later.